welcome again to Chef in My Kitchen Healthy Bites. Today, what we are suggesting for you is uh, these ones, these magic potatoes. These are sweet potatoes. One of these has got enough or four times as much for your daily intake of vitamin A. So if you're looking for vitamin A, you only need one of these a day and that is more than enough. As well as vitamin A, it is very, very high on potassium and that is very, very good for your muscles, uh, fatigue after training all day long. So what we're gonna do with this today? We're gonna roast them in the oven with tandoori spice. First of all, we'll cut them in wedges. Now I say, when I say I cut them, I don't mean your hands. Be very, very, very careful. They're quite hard and not easy to cut. So do not chop your hands instead. As I said, we're gonna uh, mix it with uh, tandoori spice. Now you can buy the tandoori spice ready-made uh, from your local shop or supermarket, or you can make it by yourself. To make it, it is very, very easy. All what you need is some paprika, cumin, turmeric, coriander, salt, pepper and a bit of garlic that is your seasoning for tandoori now if you like you can make a little jar of all these seasoning together mix them put them aside whenever you want tandoori mix is ready made there for you you can buy it but if you want to waste your money, go and buy it ready-made. They'll charge you twice or three times as much than making it by yourself. Once mixed together, we're going to add something a bit cheeky, but very nice. Maple syrup. A couple of tablespoons maple syrup. And we're going to make it sticky sweet potatoes, roast sticky sweet potatoes dash of olive oil, not too much. And as you can see, it's all mixed together. And we just put them in the oven for 20 minutes or so. So we'll put this on 180 or so. So together with the sweet potatoes, this is for lunch perfect for lunch this after training uh, or after work you don't have to train every day to eat these we've got in a minced turkey turkey is very high in iron it is one of the best meat you can have for iron some chopped onion salt I mean pepper salt, bit of garlic, fresh basil. Don't make it very fine. The finer you chop it, the more oil of the basil you waste. Now it's all done. We use a bit of elbow grease and we mix it. Again, like I've mentioned in uh, previous episodes is you don't need to do this fresh every day. You can make a big, uh, big lot fresh, then make your own little burgers, freezer bag in the freezer. The day or the minute you want them out of the freezer, leave them out for about five minutes and then cook them. And it's done. The same with the sweet potatoes. You can make a big batch of it uh, and cut them in portions in little bags and freeze them then yeah 
you save a lot of time and energy by doing it every time you want to. Right, so now it's mixed. That's a little dash of foil so it doesn't stick. And we make little burgers. We're gonna put them together in the same oven as the uh, potatoes that we prepared earlier on. And we'll just wait another 10, 12 minutes and so on. Get them both out and we'll see the results together. I've chosen the brioche, butter brioche uh, as bonds. A lot lighter, um, a bit sweeter. So, gathering with some red onions, as you can see. Uh, the filling is entirely up to you. I'm thinking more healthier options. Um, as you can see me, I won't put any sauces and ketchups and butter and coleslaw and the mayonnaise and all that. Keep it clean. Uh, that's the whole idea. Everything is clean, so let's just keep it clean. A few slices of av avocado. Some... Uh, baby cucumbers and a few plum tomatoes it might seem like he's a bit of hard work for somebody to do his lunch but if you like to eat healthy you have to put the, the work in it and really it's 15 minutes to make all these here if it's that. If you've got everything ready, it takes a lot less than that. Uh, but it's worth it. Every minute you put in it is worth it. You make sure that you're eating nice and clean there. So we'll get these uh, burgers that we've made. We can top them up with some rocket salad. How's that for a nice lunch? Look at this. Wow. Nice and sticky. And more than that, healthy. Be careful. It has got, because it's got maple syrup, you'll find that, that is, uh, it might stick to your fingers. So be careful. And uh, there you have it, minced turkey beef burgers with tandoori sticky roasted sweet potatoes. I uh, hope you all enjoyed watching us making them and I uh, hope you'll uh, enjoy making them by yourselves. And uh, please let us know if you try them and when you try them, please uh, give us uh, a line on our uh, Facebook Chef in My Kitchen or on our Twitter or Instagram, they are all Chef in My Kitchen, or even on our website, is there, chefinmykitchen.co.uk. Enjoy it.